uh, Hillary Clinton oh, went to good. a Broadway show, and uh, people look. So she's her and Bill are leaving a Broadway show. There she is. There's Bill, and it's nice to know that in America you can still do this. Yeah. Hillary, Hillary Clinton, hi. Excuse Has me, anybody excuse told you you are the super predator? <laughs> Has anybody told you you are the super predator? You're responsible for the deaths of millions. Yeah, you lizard Bill bitch. Clinton, you're a genocide supporter. Call him a Fuck reaper. you, you piece of shit. Clinton, you are responsible for genocide. You're responsible for atrocities. You're literally helping fucking facilitate the genocide of Palestinian people. What the fuck you have to say for yourself? The she takes this as a compliment? Say, <laughs> She's like, thank you. She what persisted. You she persisted. I know you can fucking hear me. <laughs> you guys are the women are dying in Gaza. Hey, what do you want? I brought slavery to Libya. <laughs> I killed more people than that. <laughs> 34,000. You expect Hillary to remember 34,000 people she killed? Me, Hillary. Fuck you! <laughs> I know you can fucking hear me. Motherfucker, Hillary Clinton! Hey, Hillary! Hillary Dyer, Rodham Clinton! We fucking see you, Hillary! Fuck you! We can see you hiding in a back-end car, Hillary! Stop calling fundraisers for genocide! Fuck you! That's how she comes. <laughs> the so, screams don't haunt her. That's what she needs for f release. That first Hillary, one. Hillary Clinton, oh, hi. Excuse me. There she is. She got him. Has anyone Wait. told you you are the super predator? If you ever meet anybody who really admires Hillary Clinton, and, and they, you know they fucked up by trying to make her the baby face in the wrestling against Trump's heel. Yes. The only appeal of her was as the 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 bad guy that your enemy loves to hate. That was her only appeal, if there was any, which there was very little of. So when they try to make that baby face turn for her, and I watch like, because I, you know, I live in New York for so long and wrote on so many things like women who were really inspired. You know what a piece of shit you are if Hillary, you really look up to her. You know, like I just absolute. You should. I know people. I know. I know uh, comedians who took pictures with her and tweeted them out. Like, look, I'm at a I'm at a fundraiser for Hillary. Look, I'm with Hillary Clinton. Comedians. I know comedians that comedians. did her podcast with her and Chelsea. Oh really? Yeah, Chelsea. You can get guess. Who? Who? They uh, still wear a mask on stage. Oh, well, I, I gotta I, tell you, there's a, so. Uh, there, there. Uh, here's the weird thing. So there's uh, some comedians who wear masks still, but then take them off to go on stage, which I find funny. It's like wearing a condom. Uh, and then taking it off five minutes into having sex and say it lessens my chances. Um, but uh, some of those people who wear masks are still friendly to me. Like even right. after all the shit, they still come over and they still, I've known them for 20 years and they still treat me like I'm just a regular, like, like normal. Mm -hmm. And so I really appreciate, Hey, I don't, you know, I have jokes about people who wear masks in my act, but I'm not going to, do it to your face. I'll be nice to you, just like you're nice back to me. It was. Hey, I appreciate that. Like I super joke, Jimmy, appreciate that. Actually, I'm not gonna be mean to a fat kid wearing a t-shirt in a swimming pool. It makes <laughs> him feel comfortable. <laughs> right. Exactly. Exactly. And uh, I appreciate that. I actually do appreciate that. I'm like, oh, look at that. Not afraid of me. Not afraid of me. A lot of people are afraid of me. A lot of afraid are. A lot of people are afraid to be seen with me. Put it that way. They're afraid to get some of it on them. You know. Um, so, uh, I, I, so uh, let me just say that without naming names, I appreciate, uh, at least some of those people, these are people some who of those mass quiet about having to suck a dick to get funding from a thing. Like the thing that's amazing is the, Oh my God, I won't be seen with the wrong person. Now all this stuff's coming out about every one of them, the stuff they are willing to be a part of. And it's batshit. <laughs> it's absolutely hilarious. Women got so suckered into supporting Hillary Clinton. There couldn't be a worse woman in the world. For you to support, I, I, they're we're honest. She's she's an evil, evil person. 
I didn't think she was the devil and until somewhat like later. Look and, what she did and, to Libya and jo- right. and joked about it. Do you well, know anything about what happened in Libya? No, they don't. They used nuke. They used uranium tip bombs to blow up their water system, yeah. which was considered the eighth wonder of the world. Gaddafi brought water to deserts and turned it into farmland so people could support them, sustain themselves. So they were the most successful country in all of Africa, and they killed him because he was going to start his own. Money system backed by gold instead of the U.S. Uh, greenbacks. Yeah. That's why they did it. And Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama did it because they do the bidding of the military industrial complex. They're fucking murderers. Well, mur- see, you got to think of it from an American standpoint. Most people in America are programmed to not give a rat's ass and, about uh, any they're not, of the people we holocaust around the world. We holocaust they those people. They only talk about the mur- like the murders of their friends. You That's know, the right. Cl- the Clinton death list should have every name in Libya, Iraq, which is millions of people. Millions of people. I don't care if they killed their friends because, by the way, the guy you like, even if you don't like them, um, Trump's probably killed the least number of his friends of all politicians Barack, who've ever been in. Barack Obama dropped so many bombs in Syria, they ran out of bombs. He got in bed with ISIS and Al Qaeda and funded them. <laughs> That's who these people are. Yeah, but you're programmed to not care about all the people that don't live here. Um, the promise of America is not giving a shit until it happens to you. And now it's starting to gonna happen to you. So you're gonna see a lot more giving a shit. And you think you care about climate change? Pro- Joe Biden blew up the Nord Stream pipeline, the biggest release of methane gas in human history. No one gives a shit. The science, trust the science. The science that's telling me uh, men can compete with women if they say they're a woman and that's fair and it's there's no difference. That's the science I should be listening to. None of the things work. <laughs> None of our institutions work. We live in not even as good as idiocracy. Idiocracy, they still could go get health care. <laughs> they still had health care even though they were all stupid in that movie. Like... It, None of the things work as well as the movie Idiocracy. Yes, I know. Come see us on tour. We're going to be in Stroudsburg, Pennsylvania, Cortland, New York, Oakmont, Pennsylvania, El Paso, Texas, San Antonio, Texas, Vancouver, British Columbia, first show sold out, Denver, Colorado, Ashland, Virginia, Athens, Georgia, and Minneapolis. We're coming back to Minneapolis. If you couldn't get tickets last time, there'll be some available this time. We're doing two shows. Go to JimmyDoor.com for a link for all those tickets. (laughs) 